Hi, this is Jonathan. How you guys doing? Today we're going to feature a pedal from NewX. This is the Overdrive pedal. This is the XTC Overdrive pedal.
Before we continue, if you like the contents in this channel, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to this channel and be part of the Patreon to support this channel. I do need your support. All right. I want to thank Mom from New X for sending this pedal uh, for review. I had this pedal a while back ago. Uh, this was sent to me like about a year and a half ago. And um, I remembered I tried this with a single coil guitar, one of the strats that I have. And I thought it was a bit harsh, a bit bright. And uh, yeah, I wasn't too impressed with it, so I kept it in a box. And uh, well, I just dug into, I just saw this, right? I just saw this in, lying around in a box. And, I just thought I'd give it another try, and this time I thought I'd give it a try with a humbucker uh, equipped guitar. Hence, I tried the Schecter uh, John, uh, Jack Fowler, and it works. Okay, so this, like you know, uh, due to what I've seen so far, uh, all the reviews of overdrive pedals that I've done so far, I, I believe that overdrive pedals um, are. No, the quality of the overdrive pedals are subjective to the guitars that you're using. And I think I've spoken about this before. Like, you know, certain overdrives uh, do well with single coils, certain overdrive pedals do well with humbuckers. I think most overdrive pedals do well with humbuckers because of the uh, the dreaded 60 cycle hum and, you know, the rest of the stuff that is going on. And single, single coils uh, equipped guitar tend to be a bit thin because there's a scoop in the mid. Uh, not all single core guitars are like that, but you know that's why we have like single single double, you know, single single humbucker because we want a bridge to be a humbucker because then you can deliver the punch that we want to. And this is the pedal uh, for humbuckers basically, and it works like a dream. You know, I was I was like whoa, <laughs> this this kind of took me by surprise. Now basically on the top, it's very basic. You have the volume and the gain volume gain and then the tone um, the gain uh, I, I was quite surprised because I thought this was kind of a low gain thing but it can actually go to like you know really face off your scalp kind of stuff you know <laughs> it's, it's like saturated you know saturated overdrive you, you can you can hit that and the uh, the tone uh, knob is very sensitive and um, it has a wide sweep so you can get pretty uh, bright if you Tone it like three to two, two three p.m. You know, clockwise. Uh, it's best to stick to noon and then adjust accordingly. You know, uh, I like to have it uh, with this guitar. I like to have it around noon, maybe about eleven o'clock. Uh, and yeah, the the amount of gain that this unit has is incredible. And even at the minimal setting, you know, you, you can get really nice tone with a humbucker, you know, whether it's in the bridge or in the neck position. Nice, nice and creamy. And the one thing that I look forward in the overdrive pedals are overtones, and this has it. This this this, uh, this pedal can uh, deliver that and and create overtones and different harmonics uh, by the way you play. So the way you play obviously plays a part because how you pick, you know, your position of where your right hand is at, and this pedal can enhance that. Yeah, quite impressive this pedal. All right. So I'm gonna put a price down here. Uh, unit is available in, in in places where new X are, new X products have been sold. Um, it's not expensive. You know, it's really affordable. All right. So let me know what you think about this pedal and leave a comment in the comment section down below. All right. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and join this channel and be part of Patreon to support this channel. I need your support. So in the meantime, you guys, please stay safe, take care of yourself. I'll see you again. Ciao.